Assalamualaikum, let me start with introduction of Gardena Company. So, Gardena Food, uh, also known as Gardena Bakeries or Gardena, is a Singaporean baked goods company with a presence in uh, Singapore, Brunei, Indonesia, Malaysia, and the Philippines. It is uh, listed on the Singapore Exchange with a VIA, it is a parent company, QAF Limited, which also owns a Bonjour Bakery and are uh, headquarters at the Chinatown complex in a South Bridge Road. Karina was established by Horatio C. Slocum, an American who was an employee of an uh, international executive service corp and worked with uh, bakeries based in the United States. Karina started out as a store bakery in Singapore, but due to demand, opened a commercial bakery at a pendant uh, loop in March 1983. This was followed by a second bakery in June in 1993. And in 2019, Karina stated that the products will be in a compliance with the government of a Singapore ban via the Ministry of Health in accordance with the Health uh, Promotion Board HPB on hydrogenated oils, a major source of artificial trans fats. Until late 2017, Carinas expand its operation to the Asian market in uh, Singapore, uh, Brunei, Indonesia, Malaysia, and uh, uh, the Philippines, Australia, and China until now. In this session, I'm going to explain to all of you about the implementation of knowledge management strategy in Gardenia. Alright, one of the knowledge management techniques used by Gardenia is combining promotions in their, in their production. Alright, the main aim of promotion is to ensure that customers are aware of the existence and positioning of Gardenia products and also used to persuade customers that the product is better than competing products and also to remind customers about why they should buy Gardenia products. Alright, these are the strategies that I'm going to explain. First, uses mass media as radio, television, and newspaper commercials. Television is often used to market new products graphically. Radio is the most common channel for informing current Gardenia auditorily. Meanwhile, newspaper frequently used as a visual medium for promotion purposes. Second, advertises its goods on social media platforms such as social networking services and blogs. The use of these media platforms for organizational communications is crucial in the digital age since majority of people own smartphones, tablets, laptops, and other kinds of gadgets. Third, engage in public awareness campaign combined with marketing programs. In addition to giving aid to the disadvantaged as well as spreading awareness on healthcare, Gardenia has successfully introduced brand promotion plans to the public. Four, succeeded in making its business the largest wholesale bakery in Southeast Asia and is capable of establishing many warehouses around all states in country and also at the overseas. This allows them to be leaders for their respective bakery companies at the national and also subcontinental levels. The next is evaluation of knowledge management strategy on Gardenia. A knowledge management strategy is a plan of action that outlines how your company will manage and centralize company information, data, and knowledge in order to increase productivity and efficiencies. The most effective of these strategies are those that are closely aligned with individual department uh, and company-wide goals. Gardena express its desire to become a knowledge-based organization in this way, a modern organization is about knowledge and how we accumulate and share with another and the rest of the world. This goal necessitates the use of knowledge and learning both internally to implement higher quality, more impactful program and externally to better position Gardenia to influence change. The best step Gardenia can take to strengthen its effort to become a knowledge-based organization is to focus on its people. Gardenia all have uh, knowledge and ability to learn and teach other. Our task it is to inform them that they are using knowledge and learning every time they tweak the process they are engaged in because it did work not so well at the last time or help the some else fix a process that is inefficient or capture that what they have done and send it to the colleague. All Gardena members have a responsibility and more importantly the right to develop and implement strong and consistent reflection of knowledge citizenship. 
treating, uh, treating knowledge management as a strategy enabler, investing in knowledge management, and then reviewing both of strategy and its knowledge management component are all things that any organization can replicate. If Gardenia learn from this review and implement activity to improve knowledge and learning, even greater things are possible in the future, and their knowledge management effort will deliver more and more value to Gardenia, their owner, uh, and partner and their beneficiaries. The quality and the quantity of audit are used to determine company success. It's because of the competition, the audit department was overburdened, uh, which caused a variety of issues. One of the company was unable to prioritize the loss and turnover of audit knowledge due to intense competition. Second, the auditing knowledge of audit knowledge was either in different seven branch in hard copy or not recorded at all. The company won't implement in this system is the research and development department and benefit because uh, it is system provide a platform for sharing knowledge uh, and then uh, which are critical factor in product innovation uh, in R&D. Following the discovery of numerous ideas circulating in forums and from various branches, the company set aside funds for the development of good idea. After investing in employee ideas, the company was able to create some amazing product which helped the company share growth. Now we're moving on to the suggestion of knowledge management strategy for Gardenia. An organizational strategy of knowledge management is not arbitrary but depends on the way the company serves its client, the economics of the business and also the people it hires. The chain of command is continuous lines of authority that extend from upper organizational level to the lowest level and clarifies who report to whom. This leads to the conclusion that the employees should be directly responsible to one and only supervisor. There are many, at least, employee that has to report uh, to two or more bosses and have to cope with conflicting uh, demands or priorities. Accordingly, some organizations believe that each employee should report only to one uh, manager. A term called is a uh, unity of command. However, the unity of command is logical when organizational are comparatively simple in contrast to the bigger gardenia bakeries, which is uh, this case unity of command are rare, for instance, in this organizational. Next, according to the portal, parameters for creating competitive advantages include close reduction of cost leadership on the one hand on time, quality and innovation improvement for differentiation on the other hand. A product positioning is the way a product is defined by consumers on important attributes the place the pro uh, and the product occupies in consumers' mind in relative to competing products. Gardenia has positioned their products strongly against competitors' products in the uh, consumer minds. For example, Gardenia has own songs to make consumers remember its bread which is so good you can eat even on its own. By listening to the song, people will think uh, the convenience Weight gardenia bread that can be consumed directly without any dishes. Besides, gardenia also positioned itself as healthy, fresh, and high quality products in consumers' mind to develop a position within segments. For the conclusion, knowledge management is not a technology center project, but technological uh, technological infrastructure is required for its success. A technology-driven system is usually easier to implement, but getting organizational buy-in for behavior change is more difficult. Strategic development management studies provide tools for effectively managing organization, but it is also entails the art of knowing when and how to apply creating thinking to guide organization as their strategies emerge and evolve over time knowledge of both the art and science of strategic management is required. We can say that a company can be very successful if it can identify the gaps in its knowledge, management strategy and implement a suitable strategy to fill those gaps. 
There are basically two different knowledge management strategies. An organization should be cautious when choosing between these two strategies based on their strategy. However, some organization can choose both strategy if their business strategy match them. Once there is a match fit between knowledge management strategy and business strategy in the organization, then the organization can save time, expenditure, and can compete in the competitive global market. Strategic management studies provide tools for effectively managing organization, but it also entails the art of knowing when and how to apply creative thinking to guide organization as their strategies emerge and evolve over time. Knowledge of both art and science of strategic management is required. That's all from me. Thank you.